I'm Ashley. And I'm Ollie, and today we're at Loini Mungalina. Loini Mungalina is right here in the north of Tasmania. But we don't actually know why it's called that, so that's why we're going to ask our friend Rosetta. This is Rosetta. She teaches us culture and language. She's lived in this area her whole life, and all of her ancestors have too. And that's why she knows a lot about it. So how did Loini Mungalina get its name? Loini Mungalina was named by the Tasmanian Aboriginal community. It's a special place for us because we can come here to collect ochre. Why don't I tell you more about the name while I show you how to use ochre? This is how we make ochre. Ochre in its raw form looks like this. And our people have collected it here at Loini Mungalina for a very long time. The name Loini Mungalina means raining rock. And the waterfall only flows after heavy rain. When we use ochre, we start by knocking little pieces off it and then we grind those up. After that, we mix the ochre powder with water to make a paste. We paint the ochre paste on our faces and bodies for traditional dance and ceremonies. Putting it on can be messy, but it's usually pretty fun. Why do you think places like this should be known by Aboriginal names? I think it's important that people use the Aboriginal names for places because they're the original names and there's always a story that goes along with them. So now we know that Loini Mungalina means raining rock. Bye, raining rock.